All righty. We got some pops. Take your shirt off. I don't want to do all that, man. Well, you wanted me to hit you with it. Either man the fuck up. Man up. No, no, no taxes. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Man, that really does fucking hurt. Oh, I think you're bleeding a little. Oh no! <laughs> well, thank you. Well, welcome to the oh! Yeah! <laughs> See, like I said, he's taking advantage of the fans out here. If you got a fan, you're one of the boys. So, say hi to the network, the No Holds Barred Network, with hi. Ryan, Lewis. What's going on? What up? How's everything? Everything's going good. It's this good. guy just had a banger match. Hell yeah. You guys will see the footage. Hell yeah. So you feel good? Yep. You had a really good match. Yeah, yeah. it was good. I think that was probably like the first time I actually seen you guys in the ring together. Yeah. On a one-on-one uh, -on -one that I've seen. Yeah, the, that's um, we faced each other one-on-one -on -one like three times and out of all of our matches, this is probably our best one. Yeah, you guys killed it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I feel like Bradley and I have always had like really good chemistry, and this match like truly proved that as well. Definitely. Definitely. So we're just hanging out uh, before the next show, the fan appreciation okay. show. So, what are you guys looking forward to? That whole special show is stacked. It is stacked. I think. I think, out of all, I think out of all the um, matches, I'm, I'm really looking forward to Chuck and Mary and Hardware. I feel like that'll be good. Yeah, I think I'm looking forward to Nolan and, and Sean Henderson. Uh, that's gonna be bigger. But even Marcus and your dad. So Marcus, I love you, man, but but stretch, bro. <laughs> I'm a little scared. No, I don't know. I mean, so. Sean too. Nolan is like the up and coming deathmatch guy right now. Main eventing, uh, he made it to the fast and main semis, yeah. TOS, I mean, he faced, those, they, he faced me in Austin. I know, dude, those <laughs> matches were legit. You can come on in here. No, what the hell are you doing, Larry? Isn't he wrestling Chuck Payne later? Yeah. yeah. So are you ready for your match? I gotta focus. I just want to miss the big red real quick. Oh. Is, th is this because you and I used to be tag team partners in a street fight that happened almost two years ago or something? I should have brought my switch. Yeah, I didn't think it was that long ago. Right? But, I had, but I had some <laughs> stuff. I forgot that was two years ago. Yeah, that was, like, that was literally like my first hardcore match I've ever had. Was it was you, Bradley, and Yeah, Mary, yeah, yeah against uh, Johnny Nova, Eddie Hawkins, and Nick was wrong. The match was great. Yeah. Good stuff here at H2O. If you're not watching, you better get on it. Right? Tell him. Tell him. Get on it. Watch H2O. Oh, go order IWTV. Yes. Like, you need to yeah, be yeah, on yeah, IWTV. Order, order it on IWTV, or if you want to because you love physical copies like I do, go to smartmart.com uh, um, and buy each and every H2O show on DVD. That's a lot. <laughs> I say portion it out. Well, there's some people that like, like you said, there are people that do like to collect and have the actual the reason why The reason why I like to collect is because in case something happens, say if I don't have internet or my fucking, or my fucking cable is out, now DVDs are a backup. I agree. Hell, hell, I, mean, hell I honestly prefer DVDs more as a primary because how I handle like streaming services is that I watch the movie on the streaming service and if I like it real so much buy the DVD? I'll, yeah I'll buy the DVD and the Blu-ray. Yeah. Hey, I can't say the same for video games though, because I only like physical copies when it comes to video games. I think the digital gaming gaming needs to bump it in the ring like mad man. <laughs> and digital gaming in my opinion absolutely sucks. It does. I do have to agree with like <laughs> you're like say say a bit like it really the one thing I really it really sucks the most in my opinion when it comes video games. Say if you're like downloading some content, like downloadable content and stuff. And especially if, especially for like a licensed game and that licensed game gets pulled off the market including all of the uh, different downloadable content you have downloaded and if you delete it, you can't get it back. It's not like a picture where you delete it and pull it from your, you know, your trash app. Yeah. When the game's gone, it's gone. We downloaded it. Like, I was so mad when they pulled off all the Transformers games off the digital market. So was Dad. Dad loves Transformers. Like, hey, like, Transformers War for Cybertron and Transformers Fall of Cybertron are some of my favorite video games of all time. And now their servers are dead, and, um, and you can't download any DLC. Like, you can't play as Jazz on War for Cybertron. You can't play as the Dinobots in the Fall of Cybertron multiplayer. You can't even play multiplayer at all, because, uh, Activision shut down the servers and even though they kind of screwed up a lot. That is okay. I should have brought my switch. I'm kind of like eating myself I mean, yeah, right now. I remember you were talking about Anthrax. Yeah. About it on, uh, I have to do that. What are the 
the shows, I'm gonna bring the Switch. And then we're, we're gonna play. We're gonna, that. we're gonna play some Mario Kart. Oh man. I, got, I say it in a very New York way, Mario. Fighting um, games, man. You say you Oh yeah, so our, uh, we'll, we'll find know, something. I was uh, also getting it. Here, the thing about me is that I'm a guy that really enjoys both old and new stuff when it comes to movies, TV shows, and video games. And, um, and one of my one game, game series I'm really getting into that came out like when I was really young was the Devil May Cry series. Yeah, that's a good game. Play that, yeah. Definitely, I mean, definitely, just, definitely really, really, really good. good. Da Dante reminds me of me a little bit because he's because not because of that fuckboyish attitude he has, but, um, <laughs> but he uh, but he does like remind me of like how like how I can be like when it comes to like talking wise while fighting and stuff as well. <laughs> We're gonna have like a series like gaming with Ryan, and that every time I see him, he's gonna have to like come up with a new video game that he like recommends or something. Oh um oh um that needs I did to be a series. I I did say this before. If I ever do like YouTube, no, we're recording. We're just we're just talking. We're on the network. So I did say you can sit with us. So. Rocket. <laughs> yeah, rocket. I did say this before. If I ever. Do I don't. Let me make sure. <laughs> Are you in the camera? You must. Okay, now you're in there. <laughs> or you can sit in my the chair. We're just hanging out. Do you have a video game that you want to recommend to? Oh man. Depends on system, honestly. You I play for honor. All players wrestling. Four riders. I like that game. Okay. Okay. Damn, this camera's just like being a butt. There we go. You gotta sit. You gonna take Tiffany's seat? <laughs> no, you can sit there. That's fine. I can be behind the cans. Real quick though, thank everybody that came out. Yeah, definitely. You guys killed it. Like, Rocket's another one that like freaking killed it with his match. Like, man, this kid. I don't understand why Rocket doesn't have a contract. I feel like a bunch of you guys. Yeah, he's one of the best. Thank you. I can sit back here. Actually, you know, like, actually, no, there's one question I have for Rocket. When's he and I going? Ooh, okay. Every time we get a match with someone else. Like you, like you and I, like heir to thy throne. We had a triple threat match match with Gigi, and Gigi won because he had. Well, help. I mean, he had stock in this corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah that, was, that was out of pocket. That was definitely. Is his name even? Oh, never mind. Yeah. I don't know. What, the camera? No, it's no, good. No, 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 no. Oh, so we're talking about Star King. Oh, okay. Let me get to Star King. I don't know. Uh, I know him back all the way then. Like, he's not here. Come in here. We're come just here, here. We're talking about the network. We're like, 26. What's up with you? So, yeah, what's up, bro? Reed's coming on this week, so like, check out on no, yeah. Under the Road. Oh, yeah, we just, so, oh, yeah, we just noticed something. Yeah. He, he, told me about, he told me about this, too. Austin, Austin, Mark, and Dylan are all in this match. They are like the kids or wasted youth, is like they call it. There is, there is. Oh God, here we go. We're just hanging out, up, yeah. we're talking about us, bro. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Yeah, and another thing I noticed, like, the kids or Wasted Youth is in this, and Reed, Rocket, Reed, and I are in this, and all our names start with R, so basically in this match, we're like <laughs> T-R or some shit like that. Yeah, we, just have we, have down on yeah. we got Red Rocket. No, 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 cut it out, cut it. Red Rocket. So we have Devin Grant here, how are you? You just got a new uh, award going on here since RS was <laughs> broken. Hell road. So you just had a big I got a trophy in the beginning, like winning, like me winning. Oh no. So now like payback? Is that gonna happen now? <laughs> So Ryan just told you that told me that you're always bothering him on FaceTime. Who, Ryan? Ryan. He knows it too. I don't want to start like oh, now. Oh, yeah. so, maybe maybe he'll come and get ya. <laughs> Reed. Yo. Handle my life work, please. <laughs> I'll hop in this. Do you not see this man? But do you not see yourself? You can wash clothes on this He's man's stomach. Go fuck work, yourself, bro. This is what goes I on. This was. <laughs> I thought this was it. I'm going to bury myself. So. Dude, Here it is. you got this up? Right. It's over with. I'm down for dinner. Um, Declan, if you're going to try and burn er, man, you should know that I can't be killed. I'm basically going to murder. Words, it's yeah. true. It's facts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not wrong. I don't want to be around for too long. 
Oh, jeez. Stare at everybody. Like, Don't feel it. I'm going to be that. Don't feel it. Oh, my God. Right. What is going on? I'm the, you, you just turned this into therapy hour now. I'm, like, <laughs> I'm like halfway done this, so I might honestly like start crying and like airing out my grievances. Well, that's beautiful. Life. That be beautiful. Okay, so do you have any... Uh, <laughs> I deal with that. Do you have any wisdom <laughs> for, right, for the go. people out there? Then? Yeah, don't be like me. <laughs> The stuff going on behind the camera right now is very serious. Like people are dancing, people are giving the fingers. Like you guys can't see this that's going on back yeah. here. So yeah, yeah like uh, if you thought this was bad, you should see what's going on behind the camera. Yeah. So what is that happening? And I love that like you guys have it all like got into the ring with each other yet. And you guys have undiscovered going on and every other Mondays and like there's still matches that you haven't gotten involved off with each other. Uh, we're trying, we're trying to make it. Honestly, uh, when we were the But it's nice too that we also see like people come in and out. I saw like Kid Osborne was here at the last Undiscovered and Eric Corvus shows up. So I like that you see like other wrestlers outside. You know what's bad about guy the last Eric Corvus, to the best of my knowledge, didn't come back to Undiscovered for like months and the last time he was here. This is the best of my knowledge, so I could be wrong. I notice 100% fact, but the last time he was here, me and I accidentally punched him really hard in the head and split his lips. He like still has the scar and everything. I love Eric Corvus. Looks great too. He lost a lot of weight. Yeah. Yeah. Just looks good guy. amazing. Good guy. I felt terrible there. <laughs> so hard. I just saw him in uh, video clips of him and Matt Vertigo in the ring recently, I think it was like two weeks ago at UWA Elite, so that was going on. I love that. I love Eric Corvus. Well, like, this, this is going on behind the behind the camera. If there was a camera behind the camera, I would show you guys. So, Bro, warrior, Louie. <laughs> so, oh, oh, man. <laughs> the amazing red Louie. That's how it goes. <laughs> so, since we were doing video games, do you have a recommendation of a video game for everybody? Um, yeah, I, <laughs> I don't play like game systems like that. I still have more six. I'm never really a big big, six, big video game guy. But the only game I have been able to put down is called the Wrestling Empire, and I got it on my phone. Oh, it's, it's ridiculous! Like you get fired from companies, you get signed to different companies, you do steroids, you die. Oh my god! Like, it's fucked. Oh, people some die stuff. like. Where they, they literally pop up with little stories like in between you doing matches, it pops up saying, like, oh, so and so was found dead in their hotel. I was like, what the fuck? It's like, it's, 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 it's weird. It's, it's a great game. <laughs> He's like, like what the hell? <laughs> you know, I, what are I told you, games you play. <laughs> uh, you know. It's a fucked up wrestling game. It's either that or just watching that. There you go. Okay, so recommendation on Netflix. Love, I love it here. I don't even know. This has gotta be like that one you turn on Netflix. What am I watching? Like the go to? Yeah. Uh, Charlotte Park. Okay, see? It wasn't that hard. It's so <laughs> bad to the point where you can't watch it. I'm about to go see that. Right. 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 Okay. Easy. I feel like everybody's got like that one go to. Turn on Netflix. It yeah. seems like, but it's like Those every time. Okay, okay. I gotta watch that. I still haven't got a chance to watch that. I, I got into it like in the beginning, but then like I, I can't watch TV series. I can never follow a TV series. Ever. I'll get two seasons in and then just. Uh, that happens. I can't stay with it. Nothing interests me that much. Everyone raved about like Sons of Anarchy. I got to. I love Sons of I liked it too. It was just, shit, it was just it was like, too many, too many. Yeah, and it's like when you're busy, I get it. When you're busy, you don't have enough time to watch the entire. Like, no, I was trying this during COVID. People are not <laughs> Are you kidding? Like, you know what I found interesting? Dexter. For some yes, reason, that show but came after shit. season five, that's like no. After season four, that's what I was like. 
Like it went downhill. What that's season what the, was it that they like kind of figured out he was killing people and they just got away? Um, I don't even remember what season, but I remember the Trinity Killer. Was Whatever one four. he killed his brother, that was like. Oh, nice well, that was the first. Was it the first season? <laughs> Was that the first season? I think, I think, or the second season? Something like that. I, I told you. Yeah, I there's like eight quick. seasons, and then they're doing a remake of Dexter. So, like, I don't know how I feel about this because I don't like how it ended. Bye, so, so, guys. One remake that was very interesting. Oh, cool. Stop remaking no. shows and oh, movies that we like. You take away from it. Yeah. So, yeah. If you're gonna remake it, do it right at least. Yeah, definitely. Like, there you go. So. Anyway, well, thank you for chatting with us on the network. So we'll get you on the under the rope soon too. And no, I'm gonna get everybody on from H2O. I'm gonna be sure so. to bury myself even more. Oh jeez. <laughs> yeah. We'll have another therapy session. I guess we're having therapy sessions. Therapy, baby, <laughs> therapy. I just had some chump cane ass in my face. <laughs> Oh my, like, okay. This is, this, this is the route my, like, whole wrestling career is going. I, I can't celebrate winning the tournament. I get Chuck Payne ass from my face. I get beat with a stick. <laughs> oh God. I don't even want to turn what, what is going on? <laughs> I'm dead. I can't. I'm gonna make merch, you better fucking buy it. There you go. I was a little boy. I got kicked. I wanted to join a soccer club, and I was the ball. So everybody was kicking me. <laughs> Joey. And then I woke up. Me versus you for it. Talking to Winnie the Pooh. Come here. Oh. Oh, we're doing another. This is, this is my Pooh bear. This is Winnie the Pooh. Hi, Pooh. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Did you have some honey? Yeah, you got honey? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, you man. What do you got there? The go back in my head. Go back in my head. Oh, no. Get, get back in there. <laughs> yeah, go back in my head. <laughs> I gotta take a shit. <laughs> I gotta poop. And by the way, Marcus Mathis sucks. Ooh. I agree. Sucks. I gotta take a shit. Marcus Mathers is so bad that Chuck had to take a shit. <laughs> My daddy gonna beat his ass. <laughs> this was brought to you by Dude Wipes. CW <laughs> champ, is this going on right now? Yeah. The people challenging for it? Yeah. Ooh. Wow. Damn. That's for a belt now. Damn. Wow. Damn. Damn. I haven't had one of these since I was 10. You know, I'm about to cry right now and you like almost break it. Me in person. Just me because you ain't changing. I'm not waiting all night for you. Let's Yeah. So finish rolling up whatever you're smoking and get your ass in the ring because we're fighting, man. Don't wait.
Fuck the count. Consequences Blish Michigan representing their dirty orphan gang and kill or be killed. He is no Blish Nolan Edwards. <laughs> and his opponent.